Part 1, Episode 14, Persecution Begins When they heard this, they were furious and gnashed their teeth at him. But Stephen, full of the Holy Spirit, looked up to heaven and saw the glory of God, and Jesus standing at the right hand of God. Look, he said, I see heaven open, and the Son of Man standing at the right hand of God. At this, they covered their ears, and yelling at the top of their voices, they all rushed at him. Dragged him out of the city and began to stone him. Meanwhile, the witnesses laid their clothes at the feet of a young man named Saul. While they were stoning him, Stephen prayed. Lord Jesus, receive my spirit. Then he fell on his knees. And cried out. Lord, do not hold this sin against them. When he had said this, he fell asleep. And Saul was there, giving approval of his death. On that day, a great persecution broke out against the church in Jerusalem, and all except the apostles were scattered throughout Judea and Samaria. Godly men buried Stephen and mourned deeply. But Saul began to destroy the church. Going from house to house, he dragged off men and women and put them in prison. What challenges me about Stephen's response to being stoned? How can persecution advance the name of Jesus? What is the Spirit saying to me?